Hi everybody, this is Refresh, and I'm here to do a traditional draft, War of the Spark, on Magic Arena. I'll be playing till I either get to 5 wins or I lose twice. So let's go ahead and get started. Alright. Pack 1, pick 1. We have Dread Horde Invasion, probably worth first picking. But other choices include Prison Realm, which is pretty good. I like... Sahili Sublime Artificer as well. Tyrant's Horde is a decent removal spell. And Larun Enforcer, I think, is probably the best common as a long term removal card. But of these, I think Dread Horde Invasion is probably the strongest. So let's go ahead and start with that. Pick two, we got Blast Zone, which is pretty good. Other than Blast Zone, Samut can be okay in the right deck. I think that. That may be banned together if I was playing green, but there's not a lot of great choices here. And I think that Blast Zone leaves me the most open to see what might else come my way that's really good. So let's go ahead and take that. Alright, now we have a Firemind's Vessel as a way to do fixing for something good in the future. We have Sky We have Herald of the Dread Horde, that's a decent card. Other than that, we're looking at Pollenbright Druid, so either Firemind's Vessel to stay open, Herald the Dread Horde to lock in black, or Pollenbright Druid to start going green. I think of these, I think Herald the Dread Horde might be the best just because I am going going with the Dread Horde invasion and it kind of is on theme. But Dreadmalk's not bad either because the Dreadmalk can, can eat the Dread Horde a mass zombie turn after turn as well. So that's something I really should be considering. And so I'm really looking at Dread Malkin, Herald the Dread Horde, Firemine, Vessel. Of these, I think I'm mostly towards getting the Dread Malkin because of its synergy with Dread Horde Invasion and the fact that it's on color and still yet a single color. I don't love it. I think it Firemind Vessel might be good as well if I had something else I wanted to go into or if I wanted to stay more open, but I think Dread Horde Invasion is a lock, so let's go ahead and take the Dread Malkin here. Now we're looking at uh, not a lot of great cards in black, and so it looks like we're going to start looking at what our other options are. Tybalt's Rager is nice. It has a lot of long-term potential because you can play it later. We also have a removal in Chandra's Pyro Helix, which is not the best removal that there is, but it is a piece of removal. And other than that, I think white for Enforcer Griffin might be good. Nothing else here is really that impressive. I think Crunch Wrangler might be a possible choice, but it's not like one that I'm dying to take, especially without anything that it synergizes with it right now. So for me, I think the choice is between Tybalt's Rager, Chandra's Pyro Helix, and Enforcer Griffin. And between all of these, I think I'm going to go with the Tybalt's Rager, just because I think it has the highest upside, and that's why I'm going to be taking that. Alright, now there are no good red cards. We, in black, we have Vraska's Finisher, which isn't bad. And white gives us a Grateful Apparition if we're going to go on the Proliferate plan. I think that the potential for Grateful Apparition is probably greater than what I'm going to be, be able to get with the Vraska's Finisher. So I, I'm really leaning towards getting the Grateful Apparition. But Vraska's Finisher is a fine card. And in green we have okay cards in Vivian's Grizzly and Ward's Kill Crocodile as well. But I think... The highest upside right now, and I'm still kind of early, is getting that Grateful Apparition, being able to put counters on things, and just getting big. And for that reason, I think I'm going to go with Grateful Apparition. Alright, Price of Betrayal is not the best type of removal because it only affects counters, and it's only sorcery speed, so I can't really do it whenever I want. So it's not... I would pick it later if it were a choice, but not right away. Dusk Mantle Operative is an okay 2-drop. Toll of the Evasion... 
Toll of the Invasion is actually probably the best pick amongst all of these cards because it lets me get rid of my opponent's bombs. And for that reason, I think I will pick that. And the fact that it amasses is also a plus. Alright, now we are looking at another Dread Malkin, which I think might not actually be a bad choice for us since we're already deep onto this plan of abusing Dreadhorde Invasion and making a mass zombies. And I don't think anything else is really screaming to us yet, so let's go ahead and take the Dread Malkin. And now we have some mediocre red cards in Goblin Assault Team and Raging Crunch. I don't think Raging Crunch is actually bad. But it's not amazing either. The last attack behemoth is nothing to write home about as well. I think for the body, the fact that Raging Crunch is a 4-3 that is only 3 mana is pretty good. And it might be the reason that I'm going to go with the Raging Crunch. The other choice is to go with Makeshift Battalion and try to get like some sort of plus 1 plus 1 counter theme going. But I'm not 100% sold on that. And... Between the Crunch and the Goblin Assault Team, the Crunch is probably the better choice, especially since Assault Team just kind of dies. Even though it does make a counter, I think getting a bit more defensive with the Crunch might be a little better here. So let's go for the Crunch. I don't think that locks us into red as a secondary color either. This, it, there's a lot of options here. Now we're looking at Contentious Plan, which actually works pretty well with the black that we have going on. And other than that, in black we have Lazatep Behemoth, not that great. Unlikely Aid, not that great. Blind Blast can be okay in a very particular deck, but I think it's more of a sideboard card. The other choice we can make is to get a Guild Globe and stay open. Mm, but between all these choices, I think taking the Contentious Plan... I think I'm going to take the contentious plan on the hopes that it's possible that blue might be open to me as well. Alright, I don't think blue is open based on this pack. Although I don't know, I don't remember if there was any good blue in this previously. But I think the obvious choice, since I'm almost certainly going to be in black, is to take the Dusk Mantle Operative, just because you know, it's good to have two drops in your deck. And then we are looking at either the last step behemoth or the war creature i think i don't think the last step behemoth is something i really want and so i'm going to take the war creature on the idea that i can stay open to white if something good comes in white as well all right we have kaya's ghost form ironclad crovod between these i don't really have much that i want to ghost for and Crovod, I guess, is a potential to go white if I want to play like a slower black-white deck. I don't think I'm taking 10th District's Legionnaire because that's kind of an aggressive card and I kind of really need to be in red-white in order for that to work. So Iron Cry, Crovod it is. And it looks like we have more white coming to us. We'll take the Pouncing Lynx and see what happens. Yeah, and the top of the statue as well. Okay. So, oh man, Rolesk Apex Hybrid. That card is so good that I think I'm going to abandon my plan here with what I was doing before and just take it and try to make it work. So, um, we're gonna ditch. We're gonna ditch the red for sure. And we're going to have to keep either black or white. And the white isn't really screaming to me, so we'll, dread, we'll ditch the white as well. Even though we have a lot of white cards. I think we can keep the blue. And maybe go black, green with a, a hint of blue to get there. But you don't pass a Rolesk unless you really can't play those colors. And I don't think I'm 100% committed to the colors that I had picked. Especially white. Although the Wanderer is a good card, I mean, there is a reason to take that, especially with all the white that I have, but I don't think it's too late for me to switch right now, and Rolesk gives a reason to do so. Alright, so we're looking at blue, green, and we're looking at black and green specifically, but right now it actually seems like blue is screaming to me. If I can get enough fixing, I could probably still play Rolesk, so... 
there's nothing really in white that's calling my name. I guess Ingress Rampage may make a argument for us to go back into red with the Tibalt Rager and the Raging Crunch. We have all these white cards as well that may make us go white, but I don't see a reason to really go that way yet. I, we could just take the Lazatep plating as a way of amassing, and I think that's not a bad choice. I think the other choice is to take the Thundering Saratok and start to try to cut into green prospectively. So it's really, I think, between the Thundering Saratok and the Lazatep plating, and I think, I think we try to make green work. So let's go it. Let's go for it. Black green is a color fixed type. Oh, oh geez. All right. Well, we have a lot of blue now. So maybe we are going to... It's possible that instead of going black, we actually go green, blue, splash black as another option. And with all of these cards, it's really making me think about going that way. I'm not 100% into Silent Submersible. It's not a... I don't think it's a great card unless you can give it some way of evasion, but it's so deep in blue that I don't think I would take it. Between all the cards here, I think I'm looking at Avon Eternal and Jace's Triumph, and I like Avon Eternal just a little bit more because it does have that mass trigger, it's a flyer, and it gives me a way to assassinate um, Planeswalkers. So of these, I think I'm taking the Avon Eternal. All right, this is not a great pack for us. We have Cruel Celebrant as a option to play if we want to go back into black and white and ditch everything that we've taken. But I think the obvious choice right now is for us to try to really push this green theme. And Centaur, Centaur Nurturer lets us splash. I know that the second choices I have here would be Temio's Epiphany and Kira's Dambreaker, but Nurturer is kind of important for us to go to deep green, so we'll take that. And then here we have nothing good in black. We have Net Narset as not a great choice because we're kind of playing a bit more into green and black right now with a splash of blue paint, maybe. The other choices are Courage and Crisis and Contentious Plan. Um, between these, I think if we're going to play green and blue with a splash of black. And let's go ahead and pull these out and pretend that that's what we're doing. So we're, we're not going to want any of these. The Dreadhorde Invasion is definitely worth splashing. I think the best choice, I think, is probably going to be the Contentious Plan. Although there is an argument for Courage and Crisis getting the counters going on creatures and then uh, proliferating. So it's one of those. I, I would take the second contentious plan over the first Courage and Crisis right now, but I, I'm not going to turn them down if I see any future of them in the future. And since we're heavy on creatures, I don't want to take Narset because there's not a lot of things that she's going to fish up. So, contentious plan it is. Alright, in this one, we are looking at Erratic Visionary, I guess? I mean, worst case scenario, we can get Primordial Worm, but I'm not loving the idea of Primordial Worm because it's such a bad creature in general. Erratic Visionary might be able to get some use in the long term with the looting effect. And Neoform, I don't know. I, I, I think I would have to have something I want to search for besides just the Rolesk in order to take it. So between all of these choices, I'm going to take the Erratic Visionary for now. All right, this is um, not the best. Tithewear Giant is something that we could splash for in black, but it's not something I love. Ashiok Skulker is a win condition. I don't love it. I think with the potential we have for getting plus one, plus one counter proliferation, Iron Bully might actually be our best choice. And it's flexible. We can fit into any deck that we want. So let's take the bully. Okay, no, now looking at this, we have a Spark Reaper, which is okay in black. But I'm not really into that, I think. But we don't really have a lot of other great choices. I guess no escape if we want to go blue. Ward scale crocodile is something we can put counters on that isn't that bad. But we really want more things that put counters on things first. I think I'd rather take a crocodile though over the first no escape. So let's go ahead and take the crocodile. 
All right, well, this is not especially good for us. Relentless Advance is a zombie creature spell maker guy, so I think that's kind of our main choice here. So let's go for that. And then, oh, hey, Laza Tip Plating came back. I think that's a decent trick. It gets us a 1 1 in addition to uh, muting a removal spell. And, I mean, Charity Structure, unlike they, they're okay. Primordial Worm is. A type of big creature to have, but last time plating I think is the winner of that one. Here, I think we don't have any planeswalkers to get back, so I'm not high on Aid the Fallen, and I guess getting Rolus back might be good, but there's not a whole lot else that I'm like dying to get back. Nag Eternal's a three drop that's mediocre at best. And so it's really between one of those two. And I guess we can I guess we'll take Naga Eternal just because I know it's gonna it has a better chance of making the deck than splashing for the Fallen right now, so we'll take that. And then we have Locksin and Sergeant War Screecher. I mean if I were in white, that'd be great, but I'm not, so we'll take Fresh Descent. Uh we'll take the inner planar beacon just in case it gets us something that we need, but we're not gonna start it. And Bane Hound is terrible. <laughs> <laughs> Time Wipe is a card that is quite good. If we could get enough fixing, and you know, this makes me wish I took the fixing in the past, then it might be worth taking, but I don't want to force it. I don't think it's worth for it forcing. I think Arlen Cord is quite good. Arlen Voice of the Pack. And I think that is going to be our number one pick here. Let the nightly hunt commence. Okay, this has some okay green creatures in Arlen's Wolf and Crawlsinger. I think Prison Realm is worth splashing for. If I had more fixing, I don't really have it right now. So is Obnix Solus's Cruelty, but again, I'm limited on fixing. Because of that, I think Teferi's Time Twist or one or Band Together, Crawlsinger or Arlen's Wolf is going to be our main choice here. As much as I want to take one of those cards, I don't think with the fixing that we have, we're, we can really afford to pick an off-color card. And so, let's see what how many creatures we have here. Whoops. We have... How many creatures do we have? We have... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven actual creatures and some potential to get creatures in the Relentless Advance and the Arlen Cord. And some of the Lazatep plating and Dirt Horde Invasion will create creatures as well. Um, with seven creatures, I think that band together might not be quite good yet, but it is removal. I'm really short on it, and I think that's what I should be taking. But I gotta, I do have to favor some creatures here. Uh, Jen Yang Gu is some pretty good fixing and adds the plus one plus one counters that I need. So I think Jen Yang Gu is our top choice here. Cooperation is the path to self All right. Well, we have Challenger Troll. I think that's a fantastic green card and totally worth first picking in a weaker pack. The Courage and Crisis of the New Horizons are also cards that I want, but Challenger Troll is a good pass up. All right. Not a lot of great choices here. I think Gateway Plaza might be worth taking over the Thunder Drake. I have two... Well, Thunder Drake's pretty good too. And now I have a Centaur Nurture and Jang Yangu, so maybe the Thunder Drake might be the card that I want here. So let's go ahead and take that. All right, we are looking at uh, not a lot of great cards. I think the Snare Spinner's a good way to gum up the ground at first, so we'll go ahead and take that. And then we are looking at a Storm the Citadel and Ward Scale Crocodile or Prismite. Nobody really wants a Prismite. I don't know if I'm really wanting to take Aid the Fallen just yet, even though I have a couple Planeswalkers and a bunch of creatures that I might want to get back. Is it better than Storm the Citadel? Yeah, I, I think this is really situational. And Ward Scale Crocodile, I already have one. I don't think I want a second. So we're going to take the Aid the Fallen as a possibility for splash. All right, not a lot of great choices here. I could take another Lazatep plating. I could take a steady aim for the sideboard, but it's a pretty bad sideboard card. I think I'm going to take a second Lazatep plating. And now we are looking at not a lot of great choices again. 
I don't love Crush Descent. I don't know how I'm doing on creatures. I'm probably low on the creature count. I have 22 playables, I guess. And I'm not really counting the Blast Zone. I do need more playables. And I am thick on 5 drops, so I'm not really into playing the 5 drop. But it's either that or Crush Descent, I guess. Totally lost. Do I, do I really want to totally lost? Mm. A 4 mana 2 2 in Crush Descent that I guess eats a couple of my opponent's car manas. But it seems so weak. I think. I think between all of this, I will take. I'll take a totally loss. Even though it's not a creature, and that's what I need. Between all these, Teferi's Time Twist. Between all these, I am gonna go... I guess I'm gonna take a, another Dread Malkin for the board. I mean, uh, Sahili Silverwing, I guess? That's... that's I can play no matter what I'm doing. Uh, we'll just put this in the board. We'll put this in the board. Okay. So, I, I don't think I got there. Yeah. What, we have 12 creatures? That's not a lot, and I'm not really playing the control game here. So I have a really... I. It's pretty clear I did this deck very poorly here. Um, I have two pieces of fixing. I should have maybe take, considered taking those New Horizons. Is <clears throat> I have all these black cards. I don't think I can go black. I committed pretty hard on what I'm doing here. So, really, I mean, the only choices I have are to splash a little bit more black and cut some of these car other cards, or to, I guess the other choice might be to, I don't know, cut, I don't want to cut creatures, so I'm going to cut spells. Of these spells, I mean, I have a lot of 5 drops here, and I don't think I want this many 5 drops. Between all of these, I think World Sports Kill Crocodile is the weakest. But then again, I have Challenge Control, which makes World Sports Kill Crocodile good. So, I cut Totally Lost. I don't want to cut Creatures, so I'm going to cut Totally Lost because it's expensive. Now I'm at 40 exactly, but... I don't know if this is what I really want. When it comes to 40, I can't go black again because that's just going to destabilize me a lot. Is there anything else that I can put in here? No, not really. Alright, so this is my terrible, terrible deck, I think. We have just a tiny number of creatures, mostly spells, but some of my spells are also creatures, so I have to consider that. Like my Relentless Advance, my Lazita Plates are one drops. And I guess the idea is that I just go big with an army off the Dread Horde invasion, and then... Yeah. I don't like Crush this set, but it at least creates a creature, even though it attacks my opponent 2 mana. And if I can nail my opponent with it, it might be worthwhile, but... And then it's just one Dread Horde invasion. I have... The Centaur Nurturer as the only means of fixing in deck. Oh no, Jan Yangu is my other means. So I have two means of fixing two swamps. That's probably good enough. And I want... I think I do want a balance between forest and island. So this is probably going to be the deck. Alright, let's call it. And then I will start playing games soon. Okay, and then let's... Let me know what you thought about that draft. I know I really screwed up and just picked some terrible, terrible cards and forced Rolesk, even though I probably should have, shouldn't have. But hey, sometimes that's what happens. Alright, here we go. Versus Lost Soul as Johnny. Ooh, I'm Tezzer right now. How do I keep myself from changing all the time? Now I'm Vivian. 
it keeps changing. Uh, no lands is, is bad lands, right? So we're gonna mull it. Two lands of off color, but I got a stair spinner. Do I need a contentious plant? There's nothing that requires it. Let's put it aside. It'd be better to get a blue land like that. That's good. Alright. I think the spinner's gonna go first. Dibble first. Get going. Oh, we got three lands. Okay, next, we'll just go on the attack. Then we'll cast one of the worst cards in my deck, Naga Eternal. Okay, three for three. That I don't care about. You can nail that guy all you want. Light shield. Okay. That stops the beats, I guess. Uh, yep. Cast this. No attacks. I kinda need uh, another land. Or a swamp. Too. Well, I can eat that, so I'm not too concerned. There's my other land. Cast the Nurturer. Pass on the attacks. I should be able to pass the invasion next turn. If I don't kill land. Uh, Alright. Cool. Nice. Yeah, I'll trade that. That's a trade I'll make. Uh... Yeah, nurture again. Get through my life. We won't attack just yet. Have a band together as well. So I guess next turn, red horde and band together. <laughs> That's really funny. Okay. Oh, we'll kill the one guy. Okay. Lot of dudes. Uh, all right, now I have five, so I kind of want to go bigger, right? Let's cast the Saraton. Stop the ground beats. Uh, no need to attack. That will stop the ground beats, and it'll let me kill just about whatever I want. Uh, yeah, that's. There are two kinds. It's a good response. I must work. Don't worry. I'll be quick. Alright, here we go again. Yeah. You gonna attack with your team? No? Eh, I can fix it. I got another door coming in. Alright, I have five mana. The ward skull crocodile is just gonna die. We'll pass the nurse the box. We'll get three life again. I need to attack. What do you have here? Calcis misses the nose caves. Ow, nice. We got all the Okay, we'll block that one. We'll take a pile of damage. Um, alright. So next I need to stop the beats. So you're six. Is there a better play? I think so. Can't stop. So you're the one to do it. And you can't be affected by the Wanderer. I don't think I can win this one. I just don't have the, uh, the support here. I could band together. I could Jung Yangu. The counter on the ward scale. Smack the fire. Come on, Noble. 
fun to have your day. I think I put it on on you. Share in my strength. I am gonna die. So I need to remove what I can. That's you. Yeah. That'll create chump blockers for days. Then I need to shoot. This one, this one, hitting this one. Oh, oops. The, the wanderer stops that. Okay, I failed. <laughs> oops, now I'm dead. Now I'm really dead. I think that's what? 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Yeah, I'm, I'm very dead. You're gonna attack. I'm gonna block. Yeah, and then I can't stop that. Then you attack with everybody? I think so. Then I will die. Oh, interesting. You're not going to try to kill me. We'll see a new Did I miss something? I feel like they had me there. Yeah. I don't think I can win this. Strike me. It's a good game. It's a good game. I mean, I was on the back foot the entire game. So, yeah. Well, that's that. Wow, I got wrecked. Granted, I have a weak deck, but still pretty wrecked. Alright, so let's see here. My opponent's on the. Totally lost would be pretty good. I might even want it more than. Definitely need the flyer, so. I think I replace that with that. Oh, wait. Push the scent. It's totally lost. Because that'll get rid of the zombie tokens and everything that the counters on. I think that's the best I can do, though. I don't really have much else, right? Let's give it a shot. I'm gonna get wrecked, but probably. But I gotta try what I can, right? Uh, let's play first. <laughs> if it's, um, I mean, I could hope to get blast zone there, I guess, with this. But should I mulligan? Or should I just keep this off the strength of blast zone? This is this is pretty bad. I'm gonna mulligan. I'm gonna die. Okay, I'm going to keep that one. <laughs> wow. Two of the worst hands I think I've ever got while playing Arena. Right here, right now. Incredible. Alright, what else do we have? Also, I get all the non-creature spells and uh, nothing else. I think I am toast. Go to attackers, go into combat. Let's... Should I just make a 1-1? One, one? Nah, let's go to my turn. Ooh. I got nothing, I got nothing. Do I contest this plan? I think I can just plan. Draw a card. Okay. I got something finally. It took a while. Alright, what do you got? You got. Well, I think you're in as bad a state as I am, I guess. Yeah, you can just learn that if you want. Or no escape. Uh, yeah. That's mana efficiency. Down on you, I guess. Wasting for no escape on something that doesn't matter. Two attackers, fast into combat. Wow, you still don't have anything? 
Well, I'm not going to cast anything if you're not going to cast anything. Skylord's a guy. Yeah. You know, the problem. Because I still don't have anything. Oh, uh, okay, that's something. We'll cast you. It'll block the ground. And then I'll be able to, to cast the Dreadhorde Invasion the following turn. And I can blast up plate in case my opponent decides to want to strike me. That I'm not gonna do. Really so. Okay, yeah. Now now the beatings are beginning. My opponent's gonna go on the attack, I'm just gonna take the hit. And I'm probably gonna lose this one off of perhaps the worst draws in the history of playing magic. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm not gonna block it, so I'll just wait. And then end the turn. End the turn. End the turn. I'm dead as dead can be, I think. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to do much about that. I'm gonna cast another spell. Yep. Yep. And then? Nothing. Turn. Alright. Well, at least I got ground blockers for days. <laughs> okay. Um. Yeah, I got nothing else. Yep. No attacks. Just die on the ground. And the turn. I'm gonna cast Master of Plating and then Resolve Count Dismissal, which will do nothing. And my opponent's gonna attack with his fires, which I can't block. I'm probably gonna die in a couple turns. So. Yep. Yeah. I guess I can cast you. Okay, that sums the flying beats. We'll put that on here. And then we'll end the turn. Okay. Uh, no attacks. End the turn. Okay, that stops the beats. If my opponent wanders me, then I can last step plating again. I'm gonna die though in five turns. So, I'm going to have to start putting down the beats, I guess. Uh, next... Attack with you. And if I lose a guy or two, I'm not gonna be okay with that. Okay. End the turn. I think you win if you just all out attack me. You're not doing it. <laughs> I am so dead. Uh, let's go! I die if you all out attack. But... But will you all out attack? Interesting. I'm gonna die! Oh, look at that. Always getting lands. Yeah. Yeah, I'm dead. But that's fine. That's just life sometimes. Uh, we'll, we'll hold that. If you just attack, I lose. Let's see. Oh, interesting. <laughs> I'm dead next turn. Okay. Um, let's see. Can I win now? If I totally lost one of the flyers and attack with everything, you're gonna triple chomp and I'm gonna die the next turn. Or double, you're gonna double chomp. Okay. So let's totally lost you. 
Why not? I'm gonna lose the next turn, so no matter what, this is like it. <laughs> nice. Alright, next to combat, all attacks. Oh, I really. That actually gates gets me a pile of life. Interesting. Interesting. Let's let's kill the Skylord. I forgot that I got all that life from the life maker there. Um. All right. I guess I live a day longer. In the turn. Maybe a day longer. We'll see. I. I should remember that. Pause. <laughs> I came back around. That's incredible. Um, all right, we'll do it again. <laughs> oh, okay, let's see if we get the worst hand ever again. Right uh, this is not the worst hand ever. I can actually keep this, so we will. Is it ideal? No. But it's it's something. And I will take something. I will take something. I have a turn three. I have a turn four. We'll, we'll pass. Yeah, my opponent's on the uh, do nothing plan, I guess. Go ahead and cast a Nega Eternal. Get on the beatdown plan. I, or, or not. I guess we'll find out. My phone is stuck on mana. Oh, ouch. Sorry. That's That sucks. Uh, go beatdown. And then play the man. They're gonna cast roll this, right? Guess so. Oh man. Are you discarding again? That's rough. You don't have a blue mana, yeah. All I do is cast roll this. And uh this is like This is gross. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe you have a base of your split no. Alright, well, that's not a fun way to win, but it is a victory, so I'll, I'll claim it. Alright, next game. Here we go. Okay, I am now, I'm still Vivian, but I'm against Ilja. Ilha? I'm not sure exactly how to say that. Hey, look! No lands. The second time. Can't keep that. No lands again. What are the odds that I'm gonna have two no land ends? We'll go we'll go one more. This is terrible. We'll keep it. Because No, no, no more lands. I need spells. Erratic visionary. Please get me there. Did my opponent also mulligan? Man. We're both in bad shape. What do you got? Erratic Visionary? Sounds impersonal. Alright, alright. Well, then we're definitely gonna have to cast this Erratic Visionary to, to be on the block plan. If you crew that, what is crew, to crew 2? Yeah, then I'll have to block. I can't let you draw cards. No, sir. Strix? Okay. That's why we play the Aven Eternal. Now we have two blockers. Three blockers. Uh, no attacks. Alright, so this is not the best situation, but it is a, a situation. 
Again, not the best situation, but a situation. And something that I can live with, I think. Uh, okay, so you've gone bigger. You can crew the submersible. I don't have any more guys, so you can knock out one of my guys. So I think I just have to proliferate and try to get something better. Yeah. Maybe you. I can't cast Dreadheart Invasion right now. So we're going to go to next. Go to next. Uh, no attacks, because we can't let that submersible through in the turn. And what are we going to do here? Or what are you going to do here? I guess that's the question. Are you going to crew it? Because I'd be glad to block and destroy that. I think I might end up making my removal for that, though. Maybe my creatures will be good enough. Okay. Alright. Great flag version. That's a thing. Yep. Yep. We'll go to next. Um, go into combat. We'll go ahead and activate you. See if I can dig for something better. Do I want a ward scale crocodile? Or do I want a proc or an island? Or a red or invasion? I don't know when I'm going to get around to casting your Heart Invasion, so... Let's ditch you. I'm going to be casting you. <laughs> There's the swamp I needed. Alright, alright. We'll, we'll, we'll keep the shame uh, alive here and just cast a Thunder Seratok. Alright, now I have a big blocker. It's not going to really matter because it's not like my opponent's going to doesn't have that law rune enforcer. Okay, so no attacks. Yeah, I'm gonna tap down Thundering Ceratoc, that's fair. Oh, I should have cast the world's ward skill card down in that case. Oops. Because it can't be targeted. Yeah. We're on the, uh, my opponent's stuck on three plan and I can't do anything about it. Yet. But, oh man, I don't know. I don't know what the plan is. We'll just say hello. Oh, wow. Nice. Nice. Okay, so you can do 4 damage. I can wipe out the Strix. <sighs> Grateful Operation's gonna get pretty big. I think I blocked you. And then... I have to, I have to take this hit. have anything in my deck that can deal with the Great Flat version. I don't I don't know that I do. Wait, I can't block that. Oh it has stealth mission. Okay. Well in that case, I'll just block this. Yep, yep, yep. Go to combat. We'll attack with you and you. And we'll leave back the Ave Eternal. Okay. Get the croc. And then we're gonna have to try to race that Eternal. I guess. Okay, the grateful operation. But it makes it so that there's not a lot of good blockers for the wards of the So hopefully my bigger guys can get there. That's all I can really think here. My opponent has a card advantage right now. Great Flaboration is going to grow out of control. So it's my job to close this out while I can. I'm going to take a while though. Il Ilja? Ilha? 
I wish I knew how to pronounce it. What do you guys think it is? Okay, stealth over weird. That'll let you get back the stealth mission, I guess. Uh, I think I have to take. I think I block this time because if you're gonna get back the the plan the next time, it's not gonna be good for me. All right, so I need to band together to take out the grateful apparition. Yep. So you and you are gonna hit you. Alright. And then I'm going to attack just you. So that gets rid of your main threat. So now I have a chance. Maybe. That really depends. I think the ward skull crocodile helps a lot. And the fact that my opponent's mana screw also helps me a lot. But once she plays another, okay, yeah, that's a guy. That'll get bigger, yep. Yeah. So now you can block with a lot of guys. You'll probably use a lot of reinforcer to tap me down. Okay, so we'll go to combat. You're gonna tap down my guy. No? Alright, we'll go. what happens. Are you going to block to rise your populace? No. Interesting. Okay. We'll cast Arlen. Make a wolf. Feel your hair, Pringle. You have this is your I have another blocker. Which can't be law rune enforced. So all my blockers can't be law rune enforced. Let's go ahead and play this for now. Let's see what happens. You got another land? Oh, there you are. Nice. You have a flyer. And you have a bunch of guys. You can't tap down my guys. You're gonna strix, yeah. You're gonna strix to hit that for one. Who's the real mongrel here? All right, then we're gonna go to the attack step. You're gonna tap down the Saratok. Yep. Uh, I'm gonna attack with you. Just you. Just the one. No, oh, there's no attack. So double block. Okay. No attacks. We will make another wolf, though. And then Arlen's gonna die. And that's fine. Please protect my pack. Uh, Alright, end the turn. And then the following turn, I can attack with a lot of wolves. The Lot of Enforcer is only gonna be good for so long. Yeah. So the next one I can theoretically attack with everybody. Alright, do you have a guy? Is that a guy? You have five lands now. That means the cards you've been holding on to are cards you can play. What is it? What is it? Play your turn! Strike? Oh, interesting. That's the one you're gonna want to strike. Huh. I would have hit the Thundering Zeratok. I guess you can't law rune enforce the wolf. You're gonna kill Arlen. Probably. Probably. Yeah, okay. You kill Arlen. Retreat into the night. I think if I attack with everybody, we'll, we'll go to combat. We're gonna see you tap down the Thundering Saratok. Or not. You can. Yeah, we'll 
Oh, it's back everybody. There we go. gone huge, but that's okay because we've gone wider. As long as you don't play another guy, I think that's game. But I think I'm going to bring it totally lost. That's, that's another guy. That's... Hmm. Now I'm not sure how to do this. Yep. Yep, we are we are at a loss here. We're gonna go to combat. We're we're not gonna attack. We're gonna end the turn. We're gonna step here. Oh, we got something else. Yep, that's good. Nice. Yeah, we'll bounce this. Alright, we'll go to end. Well, Jong Yang Gu. My strength. And then they catch everybody. I think that forces you to block that like that. Alright. It gets this for game one, and then let's see what goes on game two. I think totally lost is again a thing that I want for a crush percent. I know it's not the most even curve, but I think that's the only thing that I will want. Yeah, go! Here we go. Game two. Uh, yeah, alright. I mean, it's better than every other opening hand that I've gotten this draft. Turn two, we have turn four. My turn two beats your turn two. Then yeah, I can't I can't stop that one. So we will we'll pass. We'll pass. No tax. I'll eat the Strix, but I'm not gonna try the battalion. What else you got? Okay. Yeah, I'll take the hit. No blocks. I think blocking flyers is important here. Yep, that's a guy. Okay. 
my turn. Red Horde Invasion keeps coming out when I don't want it. Alright, take the Silver Wing. And, okay, that's fine. Uh, no attacks. Being on the back foot here is not great, but still. Okay, now you have five, which means that you can do a Wanderer Strike. Now we have blockers. Another silence of merciful. Okay. Yeah. It's annoying, but I have blockers. 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 That's a thunder drake. No attacks. Let's see what else you got going on. A lot of makeshift battalions. They're gonna grow. I'm gonna need a. No, this is Leave my territory. The pack. Or I'll remove. Go, my children. Fight. Attacks. Hope we're good. Oh, this board is pretty good. Uh, yeah. We'll do you. Let nature guide you. And I could attack with the flyers. I think. Yeah. Because I'm gonna... I'm gonna attack with one flyer. Go silver wing. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. What do you got? Yep, you got that. You're gonna hit Arlen, I'm guessing. Yep. Yep. I can't do anything about that. Yep. The moon wanes, and I depart. I got two wolves. That's pretty good. I wish I had the third bit. Not much I can do about that. Alright, next. We'll go to attackers. Silver wing again. And then we'll go to next. We have seven. We could theoretically totally lost. And and last attempt plating to beef up the thunder break if we need it. Okay, that's an option. To keep in mind. But we'll see what he or she does next. Come on, Lily. What do you got? Sudden blade angel. Yeah. Okay. That's the guy. What are you gonna do with him? Uh, nothing. Well, we'll pass. We'll pass. Seven mana. So, I think we keep this up. Change plans. Contentious plan. To be above the wolves. We will... Iron Bully. beef up the silver wing and then we will pass so now the sun blade angel is not a threat to me uh, we could attack with the wolves we attack with a wolf maybe we attack with one wolf because it's going to no, it's just going to be eaten by the skulkers if we attack with two wolves they're going to lose their weakest creatures so not yet okay we have to wait till we can affect combat nasty, in a nasty way. We're totally lost. Alright, what do you got? Anything? I don't want to run out of time, man. 
guess you have three hourglasses, so maybe not. But, taking your sweet time. much about that. Yep. Yep. Can't block that. Yep. You got me. My turn. Yep. Oh, or I guess I could just roll us. Well, let's see. We'll go to attackers. We'll go in with you and you. And see what happens. Because I want to be able to use this trick if I, if I can. What do you got? You're gonna block? You're gonna submarine? Okay, you're gonna submarine. Yeah, that's fine. Depending on how you block. Okay. Alright. Is that it? Uh. Yeah. Totally lost this guy. We'll go to damage. Yep. Yep. The last hit plating could be up my thunder rank. And then it's your turn. Maybe yours will hold. We're studying oh, contrast. You've set down the wall. I'm excellent, and you're well, not. Okay, we'll cast you, and we will put the tokens on put on the stair, the snare spinner. We'll put on the slower wing actually. All right, we're gonna go to attacks. We will attack. You and you. Yeah, we'll just attack you. All right, that's good. Hit it. Okay, let's see if you return. These results life. are an anomaly, not to be repeated. And the turn. And then we'll just pound in with the flyers, I guess. You get, you get in line. Yep, yep. What else you got? You can blink removal. That I don't care about. Okay, so now you have a bunch of Strixes. A lot of tape plating that. Alright, so next up is the big attack. I think I cast Relentless Advance up the army. And then we're gonna go to attacks. Next, attackers. And I don't really care that much. Attack with you as well. These guys are gonna get traded, but, but I kind of don't mind. Air Force is strong enough. 
Yeah. Mm, let's hold the wolves back. No, no, no. We're gonna go in the attack. It's better. Okay. I know what I'm doing. We'll do it like this. So, there might be some chumping going on. Yep. 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 Is that it? Okay. That's a that's a thing. That's a thing. This is fine. Okay. Alright, yep, that's the way I want that one. I want this one to die first. Then go. Yep. I don't mind that you're huge. That will resolve all of those. And then we're going to go to your turn. Your turn. And unless you can stop one of my flyers. That is a second victory. I think my I my opponent had a rough going on uh, three mana for too many turns, but that was pretty cool. Won that one. All right, next game. Maybe I should just replace Crush to some totally lost altogether. That might be the better case here. Granted, I've never drawn Crush Descent, so I don't know if I'm ever going to get value out of it. But it doesn't seem like a very good spell. And I'm only playing it for curve, I guess. This is not great, but it's capable. Oh, well, now we've got all the colors at least. We'll say hello. I'm Jace now. I'm against Lobster Power. That's a pretty good name. Yeah. This is... I don't... I don't see this going well for me. I'm gonna get hit for two now. I'll be able to block the Reaver soon. Oh, hey. They're also playing this all time. That's cool. We'll do the same thing. Play this. Play the bully. Put the counter on the bully. Now I can block the Reaver safely. Advance next turn. I guess you're dark deeper in black. Conjure it. Yeah, that's not good. Um, we'll play this. We'll play this. I should be able to band together to take out the conjure next turn. No. Nope. No attacks. See what my opponent has going on. Yeah, you're gonna tap. Okay. Oh, okay. I wrote an entire treatise on your impending All damage that would be able to die. I find your attacks unoffensive. Okay, next turn. Interesting. All right. Well, we'll play you. We'll just do a contentious plan. Oh, that prevents me from casting. Lazatip. Interesting. Well, that means that I have a perfect blocker for Ugin Ugin's Conjurant, so that's actually fine. We'll cast you. You cannot be dealt with. Uh, and no on the attacks. Yeah, no on the attacks. one of my guys? You're going to destroy one of your guys. You're smart. Oh, yeah, okay. that's, bones will read as omens. that's the appropriate way to do things. You're going to lock down my... 
perfection okay. yeah. is unattainable, so stop trying. Take a whack. It's fine. Try not to think too hard. I'm going to play this. And then... I can band together to take out the Conjurant. Okay. So... Band together. Tap. Target up to you and you. We'll attack you. Two target creatures control. Target this creature. Then we want to attack you, and we want to attack you. I will leave you guys back as a blocker. This iron bully does nothing. He'll try to prevent. Yeah. Okay. All right. Interesting. I would have stopped the attack on Hog uh, to get more value. Yeah, that's what I would have done. That's fair. Yep, yep. Okay. This outcome surprises even me. And then we're going to end the turn. We'll go to my turn. And then if you use AWB on me, that's fine. You're gonna try to hit me with that. Shadows. Much easier on my turn. To reply with this. Okay, so now we're going to go on the attack. Demon. Will contentious plan to yeah, contentious plan to start. Yeah, it's fine. It is just a uh, we're going to go to combat. Headache. Swing you at, at you, you at you. You at you. You at you. You at you. And attack. Yeah, I have right. some so fun now you've got no board presence. Escape. And I have four guys. We have more cards. But I don't know. Do guys beat cards? I guess I'll find out. Alright, what else do you got? So you do a whole bunch of cards. Prismite. I'm not all that interested in Prismite. Okay, Prismite's strong, so that's good. Okay. We'll just make our team big and attacky. And then go everybody. I'm guessing we lose the ward skill pocket out. I think that's fine. It's a fine trade to get all the damage in. Another turn. Game. Game two. Again, I'm not really feeling the crushed descent. We'll replace you with the we lost. Go! Alright, Lobster Palace, game two. Let's see what you got. I think he just flooded out is what happened. Because he would have played a creature were he able to play a creature, right? This is this is worth keeping. I have a two drop. Three drop. I have I have things. Last time's plating is a lot better than I, I thought it would be. I don't have to do it that much. Then, what do you got? Oh, right, That's pretty good. That's pretty good. We'll play you. We'll play you. Counter on you. And then no attacks. So we gotta protect John. Unless you got some sort of removal. Still the guy. Let's add this battle to your record of bad decisions. 
There are many who have turned weakness yep. into a virtue. Yep. So this is no attacking. I need more creature. Uh, I want to... I guess that Dovin is really killing my style here. Alright. I know that it's going to be good for John Yangu. I'm going to put one on you again. We'll do this together. And then we will end the turn. Go to attackers. End the turn. And then we'll just keep getting Guy out of the Red Horde invasion. Yeah. Yep. What else you got? Yeah, that's fine. I find your attacks unoffensive. Next. We're gonna attack John. And I'm going to time twist. Ah, tough lessons. life on each plane gives it personality. Play you. Uh, we have one damage. So if we put a counter on you. I will help you through this. We can. Can we cast you? Oh, we can. Okay. Yeah, I think we just go to next. Go to attackers. Uh, no attacks. Cast you. Make a wolfy guy. Brave. Pass the turn. And then depending on what my opponent does, I just get bigger and crazier, right? I think so. I think so. Oh wow! Nice. Further. That's a that's a good play there. There are okay. many who have turned right. weakness into a virtue. Uh, do I just can just plan? Go to attack. Next, we're gonna attack you to you. Go. Okay. I'm just gonna let through. Alright, that's fine. The facts can't be denied. In that case, I am we will beaten. contentious plan. Yeah, everybody gets one. I'll play you. Uh, we'll hold steady here. Okay. You've got things, but I've got responses to things. Yeah, okay, that's real. Uh, yep. Okay, end of combat. End of combat. For my turn, we will band. We will band together. You and you will hit you. And then we'll go to my turn. And we will. Everybody attack. Okay. We cast Thunder Drake. We'll put a counter on Thunder Drake. Teamwork is straight. Turn. And then see what you got. Fortunately, I have just enough mana to protect my own Thunder Drake. Yep, yep. That's a thing. Okay. 
I couldn't respond to that? That's not fair. I had this. Uh, I should have put myself on total control mode there. I thought That's not cool at all. What are you, three? You're one? That's the last sound. Alright, well, I'm, I have the race, so we'll just go on the attack. Yep. And then we'll, we'll just charge black zone as needed. Alright, what do you got? Do you have removal? You have Parthelion. Jeez. That's... That's a thing. Okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Um, we're gonna put... One, two, three... Pay four to two on the on blast zone. One, two, three, four. Oh wait. Okay. Put X charge counters. X equals two. Yeah. There we, go. we can destroy that. I think. this down. You're gonna... See, you can... You get first strike and attack. And you can crew that with both of you. I'm gonna get through with this guy. Then you're gonna create all the Vigilance Angels. So that's not gonna actually help. Um, but I can blow up this guy. Okay. So, we're gonna blow up... Blow up this. Through the guy. Yeah. Yep. Okay. And then we are going to end the turn. Uh, no attacks. Oh, I guess I should have attacked. Oh well. We'll see what happens this turn. Oh, dang. Nice. Yeah, you got it. I believe that's a loss for me. I don't know if I can draw anything that gets me out of this. Yep. 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 Well, we'll do this. I mean, it doesn't matter, but we'll do it. Eh, yeah, that's a good game. see this one. Next game. I think this is still what I keep. I don't think I change any of this. Yeah. Well, if you have Parhelion, then I guess Crush Descent actually gets better. Because 8 mana, come on. Who's going to have time to cast that? Lobster Pass. I don't have a lot of time. I have to pick up my laundry in 10 minutes. That's right. I'm doing laundry while playing Magic. Uh, we're going to play first. We are not going to keep this hand. We're, we're going to keep this hand, though. Yeah. Keep. Uh, yeah, I'll keep it. make some tempo with that, I guess. You. Cast you. Let's see what else you got. Wow. Somebody resolved Parhelion and, and wrecked me. Uh, we'll cast this. We'll cast the bully. We'll put the counter on this. And we'll go on the attack. And then what do you got? Okay, Gabriel Plaza, so keep on the attack. Uh, next, next, all attack. 
X. We're gonna have to be as aggressive as possible to win on three lands. So, let's see what we can do. My opponent is trying to get to party, Leah. That's one thing. But. Man. Alright, alright. That's fair. We're gonna do this. We're gonna. We'll attack with both of these. Let's see what my opponent has going. Nope, nothing. Okay. And then we'll end the turn. We'll see what you got. Okay, alright. I'm not gonna block if you attack. I'd rather just be on the assault here. Yeah, alright. Worth it. I'll brush this in anything that you send at me. Alright, we'll play this. We will attack. Next, you, you, and you. If you double block that guy, I will make my guy big enough to, to eat your guy. Uh, sure, like this. Last step plating. Eat your guys. Turn. And then what? I really like last step plating. It's like potential combat trick in addition to being a removal defense. Okay, roll us hybrid. Yep, yep. We'll play challenger pull. And then I think we keep going on the attack. You're gonna eat that but take four. Yep. Yeah, you'll eat that, you'll take four. Then it'll still be hard. You can't attack. You can't double block the challenge at all. I guess you might have removal, and that'll make this hard for me, but I have to press my advantage while I can. Yeah, alright, that's fair. Do you have a guy? Okay, alright, that's good. That puts you back in this game. Uh, we'll cast this Thundering Ceratok, I think. But I think we hold back on the attacks afterwards. Yeah, okay, Ceratok it is. Uh, no attacks. My opponent's stabilized. I gotta beat you faster, though. Come on, man. Shadow Mage. Now, yeah, okay. I'll still have time. But don't think you'll be needing that. Sure. Yep, yep, sure. Yeah. All I've left you is pain. Yep, we'll, we'll do that. We'll go to next. Go to next. I attack you with that, you'll just bounce, uh, those Those all bounce, right? Bounce, bounce. Yeah. Okay, no attacks. End of turn. Yeah, okay. Now, now it is no longer looking like I'm winning here. Nice, nice. Well done. Well... Pass, pass. Go to my turn. Yep. Struggling. Good. We'll do this. Uh, crap. Wasn't expecting to get that. You're just gonna eat my hand. All right, we'll just go to the lion. And we'll pass. You'll eat my guy. But I think I've lost this one. That Rolesk really 
just put the damper in my uh pick your brain for a minute. Alright, now you're gonna get on the beats. Block. Oh, why didn't you attack? Loneliness can hurt. Alright, well, we'll just draw. Yep. Uh we'll keep that. End the turn. No tax. End the turn. I don't mind losing that. Your mind. Oh, nice. That's that's it for me. I think I lose next turn. Uh, Zhang Yanggu. You guy. Hi, I'm Jiang Yanggu. Pump that guy up. And this is Mo Wu. Share in my strength. All right. Well, I'm gonna lose. So let's. No, I'm not doing that. We're going to next. We will attack with you. And just you. I guess you eat a guy no matter what. And then I'm losing that next turn. I mean, wouldn't you just take it? I would just take it. Oh, interesting. All right, well, we'll eat you, and then you. Doesn't really matter because I'm losing next turn. And then, yeah. Yeah, that's a good game. You got me. Yep. Yep. Man, if I had kept that, kept that crush descent. Going on the attack. Make some angels. I'm gonna die, so just do it. Yeah. Okay. Wow, you're really conservative. I have nothing in my hand. Blockers, you can kill Zhang Yanggu. All you like. I'm just gonna die the, the next turn anyways, so. Oops, that's my laundry alarm. All right, I'm gonna lose soon. Let's see if there's one more card I can cast before, before I do. Yeah, okay, we'll cast you. That's a card. Alright, that's really a good game. You got me. And I've lost that one. Man, Parhelion. Lost to Parhelion twice. Yikes. Well, I've got a Frilled Mystic knife. So, as I mentioned, I'm going to drop the Crush Descent for the other Totally Lost. Because I think it's better in the first game. And I'll keep Crush Descent wipe something on the second. Alright, next game. Let's try it. Will I get to win three? I don't know. Here we are versus Mr. Carmageddon. It's the fairy. I am Sarkon. Okay. Uh, play first. This is not a great hand. I think I keep a two drop. A two, a two lander. So I can get this just plan out. Okay, yeah, we'll keep it. It's not great, but... I'd rather not go to six if I don't have to. Okay, my opponent went down one. Okay. Say hello, we'll play island, and we'll return. Okay, that's not what I want. So we'll do this, and we'll contentious plan. I guess we'll play this plan now. I want to plan. That's not going to land, but it's one step closer. 
Oh, wow. Nice. That's, that's, that's pretty good. Uh, Iron Bully, I guess. But I think I'm gonna lose this one with you getting that so quickly. I mean, I guess I can totally lost your giant army once it becomes giant, but I don't have a ton of hope for this. Wolf that blinks my attack. Um, I guess I cast the snare spinner. Yeah, cast the snare spinner. And then another trap. Yep. No attacks. In the turn. Can't do much about that guy. Okay, you're gonna attack. I can't do anything about that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. What, what else you got? Nurture. Can't do anything about that guy either. Resolve it. And we will go to my turn. Okay, I'm gonna do exactly what we're doing then. We'll do the same thing. And we will, we will not attack. This is this is not looking good for me. No sir. Appreciates my handiwork. I don't I don't like this. Um I can cast you? Oh, off the nurture. Yeah, okay. we'll cast you off the nurture. That's okay. Uh we'll put the two on the spinner. Spit it out a little. No attacks. That's going to attack the Vraska, yeah. All right. I think that's that'll. You're gonna use it. I've done things I'm not proud of. Okay. We'll cast. We can't do. Uh, we're gonna go to attack. And we'll we'll attack. Get her off the battlefield. Okay, well that's fighting. Yep. You die. It's not often I'm outmaneuvered. And then I guess. I guess we stay put. Yeah. Yeah, you're getting bigger. Yeah. yeah. I think I let myself take that hit. Yeah, that's fine. Whatever. Yep. Yeah. I lost that guy, I think. 
Blockers, damage. We'll do this. This. Yep. Make you bigger, and let's let's spread out the love. Uh, okay. Game two. I think this is fine. Let's let's stick with it. Sideboarding. Here we go. We have it's not a great hand, but I don't think we can ditch this one. We'll say hello. I don't remember if he said hello before. Oh, my poor opponent. Starting off one slower. I guess it's good for me though, because I'm, I'm on a slow plan too. Two black manas. At least he doesn't have turn two. Uh, Dreadboard Invasion. Yep. Yep. My turn. Yep. I've got no turn 3 plays either. So we're going to next. Alright, what do you got? You got 4. Yeah? Uh, eh. I'm always going to my next place. Just bounce that. Thank you. We'll play you. We'll play Thunderbreak. Attack. Oh wow, that was that early scoop. I guess they had all lands. All right. Great, more prizes for me. What did I get? Another Field Mystic. No, oh, it's like Field Mystic Day. Here we go. This versus Dynasty. Also a Johnny, and now I'm Jaya. Oh, my opponent gets to choose. Oh, but now I am Vivian and used the fairy. I guess it doesn't stick. This is, this is really slow. Do I keep this? I don't have anything to turn for. No, we'll keep it. It's not great. But maybe we'll we'll get something we need. Okay. Now this is kind of bad. My opponent's got a bit of a more aggressive start. Counting in for damage. We got turn two. Yeah, little guy. My assistants are painfully slow. You're nothing. I'm gonna have to wait till I relentless advance. By then, who knows what you're gonna have. Yeah, go ahead. Take. You're gonna take my challenger troll, I'm guessing. I mean, that's what I would do. Yep, nice. My Still friend one. is here to help you. Alright, let's advance. That'll slow down the beats. Unless my opponent's got removal, which I'm sure that they do. Yep. It's very aggressive. Alright, we got you. We got a Thunder Drake. Yep. 
Yep. Wow. All right. Yeah. Very low to the ground and aggressive. Uh, I mean, I'm only gonna I'm gonna cast you. It's on the nice turn. to meet you. Next. I'd love a friendly duel. That was wrecked. Okay, I cannot keep a slow hand for this guy. I need to speed up my hand. I think that's the best I can do. I don't really have anything else. This is just a slow deck. Alright, well, better luck this time, I guess. Uh, we'll play first. I can't let... Uh, okay... It's not great, but it's something. We need a green. It's not green. Let's dig. Alright, I can control something. Probably have a lot of good removal, though. We'll start with a Naga Eternal. Nice removal bait. I don't have a blocker. on the the beatdown plan. Yep. That was the point. Use your removal dot deck on that guy. Which is fine. Six. Six will hit me. And even if my opponent has the Sarkin thing, I should still be able to get past it. Okay. End of turn. Alright. 
game three. Yeah, I cannot keep too slow of a hand with this one. Very aggressive. Not great, but keep. Nope. Getting started. Alright, we gotta turn to Dreadhorde Invasion, which is good. Probably got Obnisless cruelty. Cool. Okay, that's fine. It'll take my ward skill carcade out. Probably. I mean, there's no point in crush extending. Oh, interesting. Alright. Alright. So, we'll play this. you three to blow that up. I think I'm gonna just put across. Get the defense going. Uh, no attacks. And then then I have to attack like crazy because I don't have a lot of time. I need to get my zombie army up in a hurry. I don't know that I have the time the time. Resolve. Uh, crap. Let's 
bad. It's bad. Am I gonna get there? Okay, this is good. I'm gonna cast you. Yep. That'll save me a few turns here. Next. Next. Uh. I can attack with you. And trade you. Yeah. If you want to trade. That's her. Oh, wait. That's pretty good. The immortal be called what are you gonna do? Will be your guys? end. Okay. Nope. Yep. Yep. Pass. My turn. Uh, we'll continue to play. Yep. Then we will attack. You're going to attack here. Because I can trample through. And you. You will not attack. My schemes have been foiled. Okay. I don't have a lot of time. This kills a four, huh? Yep. Alright, we'll... We'll put a stop here. Turn this to five so I can burn that down. Stop that. Pass. Go to my turn. Okay. We're gonna go on the attack next. If we kill you, then it won't matter. Yeah. Okay. You're gone again. I have other schemes to attend to. Play you. And then we'll end the turn. Oh. Okay, so we'll blow powers that guy up. Yep. Yep. I need to get more inevitability myself. Uh, let's see. One, two, three, four. I have three spells. Can we just take the hit and get back? I think so. I'm going 
block next turn, though. Can't take, I can't take these hits no more. Okay. You've got a bigger guy, but I can still block that guy. If you attack, I'm just gonna return the attack. Okay, that's fine. I can't... Can you attack with everybody? What's the combat math here? Okay. Alright, if I attack with this, you'll block, you'll double block. And I will kill one guy. You might spark Reaper, but it might not be worth it. You have a bunch of mana open. You might single block and trade. That's another thing. I think I hold back. have to block at least once, but I don't think I need to wait until you get to be a bigger size. Okay. Well, that's a thing. So now I'm on the chump block plan. Yeah. That's all I can do now. Big. That pair of giants is really big. Alright, alright. That's all that. We're gonna have to get you to six. And the combat. My turn. We'll, we'll put another one on you. out there. One left. I think I have to risk it. I've got a response. Oh, right. Yeah. That's right. Oops. I forgot about that. Uh, okay. Well, it doesn't matter now, so... We're good. We're gonna die. Yeah, we're, we're, we've lost this one, guys. 
I don't think we're gonna get there. He's gonna attack with the Dread Malkin and the Spark Reaper. I'm going to have to block. Oh, yeah. Good game. You got me. Let's see if he remembers to attack. Or, yeah, a Johnny's a key. And Jai's down. Alright, that ends my run. I tried, but uh, I didn't get quite where I wanted to. And ended this one with, uh, I got a reward for playing at least three wins, which I guess is enough to get some gems back. Let me know what you thought about the games, if I made any major misplays. I know I made some. I probably admitted to a few of them. Alright, we got some packs and some gems. Let's go ahead and open them. Let's see what we get. Alright, we got... Missa! Oh, wow. I wish I had her in draft. Alright, first pick, Nissa, easily. I think if it weren't for Nissa, I'd probably take the Spark Harvest. Finale of Glory. Wow. All right. First pick, Finale of Glory. <laughs> if it weren't for that, I'd probably take Bleeding Edge. Here we go. I got a Living Twister. First pick, probably Living Twister. But second choice would be Jaya's Greeting in this pack. Ravnica at War. I think my first pick in this one would be Arlen, and the second's kind of tough. It's going to be between Thundering Ceratok and Toll of the Invasion. I think I'd take Ceratok before I take Toll, but, you know, there, if this were later in the pack or something, I might be more interested in Toll depending on what had already drafted. Alright. Well, that's not a choice. Uh, between all of these, I think I would either take the Avon Eternal or the Spellgorger Weird. I don't really love the other ones as much. And if I really had a choice, I'd probably start with the Avon Eternal just because the two bodies for one is a little bit better, I think, than Spell Spellgorger Weird, which you really want to be in a very specific deck. Centaur Nurture is also in the conversation, but it's a bit slow, so. Last pack. What do I have for my rare? We got single combat. Single combat's not bad, but I might actually take Wanderer Strike over it because, you know, you you get to only keep one and they get to keep one, but theirs could be better than yours, and there's no saying that it's they're not going to run with the game if you can't cast creature spells either. So, yeah, I think my first choice in here would be Wanderer Strike, just because it's guaranteed removal. All right, so that was everything. Let me know what you thought about the games in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button if you'd like to see more such videos, hit subscribe. This is Refresh, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.